At the recent COG three-man clinic held on the campus of Franklin Pierce University, the buzz phrase seemingly heard throughout the week was safe umpiring. For COG president Darren Seeley, safe umpiring is easily identifiable. When asked if there is a negative connotation associated, Darren responds emphatically. Absolutely. It tells me right there that they're not comfortable um, working either in the two-man, three-man, or four-man systems, or you know, they're not comfortable with the mechanics of it, in that they're basically they're not comfortable with their own abilities to be able to push themselves into getting into the optimal positions. Darren believes there is a direct correlation with being comfortable and the mastery of mechanics. While acknowledging this dynamic is difficult, he makes it clear his expectations when observing his staff will not waver. As a supervisor, I'm not looking for that umpire who's looking to get into that okay position or oh, I can see it good enough. I'm looking for the umpire who's willing to and he wants to get into the optimal position. That means you can't just play it safe. You have to push not only yourself, but push the mechanics and the envelope of the mechanics so that you get into the best positions to see that play. A safe umpire to me is someone who says, I'm gonna get in this general vicinity, let me get here, I'll take a decent look at it and then make a judgment on that. I don't want that. What I'm looking for is the umpire says, I'm gonna push myself, get myself in the upper position and actually see exactly what's happening and then make the call. Let the play dictate the call. Don't apply a judgment into it.